Hello ladies and gentlemen, it is Daniel aka Dfish Not Fisher and um, I am in Minecraft 1.0 once again here with, I guess you could say it's episode 2 the other episode was just, you know, me jizzing in my pants over the fact that the game is finally released um, I'm still very excited uh, to be honest, but you know I'm a little bit more calm down now I don't know if you like that, you know Whatever, no big deal. But, um, I've been wanting to start my Let's Play for a long time. And to be honest, it's been difficult, especially with all these pre-releases coming out. And all this terrain, you know, or biome generation code changes. and uh, So, it's a very, very, uh, you know, comfort comforting thing to know that this game is relatively finished. Or, you know, whatever. That there's not going to be major changes to it anymore. Or at least for a really long time. So, so you know, that, that lets me know that I'm going to have, um, you know, a decent amount of time to start my Let's Play, to get it going. Because I've been playing by myself for a long time. Um, or playing single-player survival for a long time on a couple different wor worlds. And, you know, they're turning out nice or whatever. But I want to get it on footage, man. I want to have some commentary over it. Just for myself. Not even, like... I want to entertain you guys, but me, myself, I kind of want, like, a memoir. Like, some kind of, t you know, token of accomplishment. I really don't... Some kind of, you know, uh, proof or something to look back on. Kind of like a diary for Minecraft. You know what I'm saying? So, like, like lo video voice log things for Minecraft. Because really it is that kind of, that kind of thing for me. But, anyways... Uh, last episode, I just jumped down here neglecting all, all sanity or whatever the hell. I can't even talk right now. I'm just, I'm still kind of hyped up, but neglecting all correct things in the world. Just jump straight down and, you know, did my thing. Uh, this ravine isn't really that big, so I should probably go back up. <laughs> I just did it in the moment. Plus, I didn't even, like, get my bearings. I didn't even look around, so. Let's see. I'm just gonna get right. I'm grabbing some dirt so I can get up. Alright. I got some iron out of that, though. So, it wasn't all bad. Let's do it. I'll use the water, too. So, I don't have to use all of it. All of the dirt, that is. So, I'm still excited. You know, this game is uh, officially released or whatever. And uh, I really don't, to be completely honest, I'm not exactly sure what exactly that means. Does that mean that it's not going to get any more updates? It's not going to get any feature changes? It's not going to... Um, uh, to me, it really doesn't... It means they can charge the full amount that they've... They, <laughs> they can charge the full amount that they mentioned on their site that it would go up to, the price. But... That doesn't mean anything to us, you know what I'm saying? But, and I was thinking about this earlier, you know, to me it's not really, I'm not really happy for us, the, you know, the fans of Minecraft. It's more of a happiness for Mojang and, um, and you know, uh, especially Notch. Notch to me is like a special story. Um, you know, he started his own company all by himself. It's amazing to me. It's something that me personally would aspire to be. And, you know, following those footsteps. So, I want him to succeed. And, you know, this game coming out is just another step towards, you know, whatever other endeavors he's going to take. If you hear my mom in the background, you know, don't even worry about it. Ignore her. She's not important. Um, or my brothers, for that matter. Any one of my family members. Not important. Um, <laughs> um, what was I saying? So, yeah. And scrolls. I'm looking forward to scrolls. Um, I heard somebody say it's like a board game type Magic the Gathering, which I actually am a fan of Magic the Gathering, or was a fan of Magic the Gathering. And I'm hoping that, like, I trust Notch and the whole crew with making something different. Um, and that's what I would hope that they would do. Instead of, I'm not saying that it's not going to be different, but saying that it's going to have its qualities that other games don't have, like longevity and, um, you know 
fairness. Like, there's no, like, you know, Call of Duty, for instance, there's so much cheese in that game. You know what I'm saying? In general. And there's always going to be cheese in Call of Duty games. But, you know, I want games that are cheese, you know, quote unquote cheese free and have certain qualities that a lot of other games don't have. And Mojang seems to be able to deliver when it comes to that, um, at least so far. And we've only had one game. <laughs> but yeah so as of right now they have they have my attention you know in that way so kudos to them you can tell that they're trying to sell you know the new new product because you know it's not it's not beneficial to them money wise to continue to work on a game that they've already made their money off of and I'm not saying that that's all they're thinking about I'm just saying that they have to think about you know food <laughs> okay, so um, dang, it's also nice right now. I haven't talked about this much on my channel yet, but for me to not have that uh, the time restraint, because before I would have to like time myself and try to fit into the the fifteen minute boundary, but now I don't have to do that. Thank God, and I'm just playing until I don't feel like playing anymore. All right, so there's some sugar cane around here, like a ocean-ish, not an ocean, a river, right? A river. I don't like these trees, so I might just move. Oh wait, is that sun going down? Holy shiz cakes, mother shafushashasha! I'm just gonna go pick these things up. Hurry up, Daniel! Slow. I see some regular trees in the distance. Yay! And I'm in a regular forest biome now. Okay, so uh, I haven't seen one animal yet. And I'm probably going to die 